Alright guys, what is up? It is AppSmart101 here, and before I start with today's app review of Night Sky 2, I want to first tell you guys about the school and the thing. Hey guys, I just saw this really unique YouTube channel where you can find all kinds of quirky video game skits and mashups. Here's a clip, roll clip now. Subscribe and you'll see video game, machinima, and hilarity all rolled into one. What are you waiting for? Subscribe! 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 And welcome to my channel. That channel's called iBeckham and he wants me to tell you there's plenty more where that came from. Click here on the screen right now to watch the full skit and be sure to subscribe. Alright, so here we are in the main menu. Alright, up here we have search. I'll go back into that in a second. You can see here on the side we have a few different options. We have, uh, we can share this app with our friends, stuff like that. Okay, down in the bottom corner we have settings. Uh, where we'll actually be able to turn different things on and off. You can see here we can turn on sound effects. Here's basically all the different things you can do. Alright, so right here we can turn compass interface on and off. We can recalibrate it. That's how you move the device and find different stars. Here's reality. You can see uh, whatever you're looking at right now through the camera screen, you'll actually be able to actually see it on the app. I'm going to turn that off because I don't really like that. We have night visibility mode. Uh, I'm just going to turn that off. You can see it's changing colors just to make it easier to see. Okay, we can turn satellites satellites on or off. I'll just leave them on here. You can see we can turn uh, sky tracking on or off. I'll just turn that back on. Okay, we have 3D Earth mode where we'll be actually we'll actually be able to look through the Earth, uh, different constellations and stuff. I'll turn. I'll go back to sky mode. All right, so here on the side, this is my personal favorite about the application. You see up at the top we have sky info. This will tell us basically uh, what days the weather is going to be like. Uh, so you can see Friday, we can see if it's going to be a full moon or not. Whatever day we want to, uh, we, it will say whether it's a three-quarter moon or whatever it's going to be. It says uh, the day length, sunrise, uh, sunset, and height. All right, so we'll just go back. Okay, and I'm actually going to show you the next one here. So you can see we can actually join the community, which actually costs extra, but that allows us to uh, actually talk about sky grazing with other people who have this application. This is my favorite part about the application. We can actually see on what days it's going to be best to star, star graze. You can see Friday's going to be poor, Saturday's going to be fair, Sunday's going to be poor, and Monday's going to be good. Sometimes it's great. Uh, those are the days I like to go out. You can see if it's going to rain here, what chance it is. You can see it's really likely it's going to rain. It's 90s the whole week. Uh, it will tell you the temperature, pretty much everything you want to know. How many clouds are going to be in the sky, anything a star grazer would really care about. Okay, so now that we've went over that, I'm going to show you a little bit of the app. So you can see these are all satellites here. Uh, we can move our device around and check out different things. We can also go right here into search. We can uh, check out constellations, planets, stars, satellites. We can also search here. Let's search for, uh, let's see. Let's actually search for, uh, cancel. Okay, so we're here on constellations. Let's keep going down. Now we're on stars. Let's see. Let's see one everyone would know. Here's planets here. You can see Mercury. If we wanted to check out like the moon, we just click on it. We can check out info on the moon or find the location of the moon. We'll just I'll just show you guys info on the moon really quick. So you guys can see here it's like a Wikipedia page for stars, satellites, constellations, anything you want to know about. You can see you pretty much have everything you could want. You have the volume, mass, everything. Uh, and then it will give us a little description of the actual moon or whatever you're looking up there at the bottom. Okay, we'll just actually click on the moon again. We can find the location of the moon on the application. You can see the arrows directing me to go down there. Okay, so we'll just... So you can see how the arrow is directing me. I'm not going to show it to you guys. It's hard to show you on camera, but you guys get the idea on what to do. Overall, I give Night Sky 2 4 stars out of 5. If you're into star grazing, it's a must-have for any star grazer. It will give you the weather, whether it's a good night to go star grazing, everything you could possibly want. It will tell you where constellations are, satellites, planets, everything you would ever want to know. I definitely recommend you check it out if you're into stars. 
Alright guys, please follow me on Twitter for updates. Also don't forget to click that yellow button down below that says subscribe. That just lets me know you guys enjoy my videos. It's completely free. All you have to have is an account on YouTube.